Other interesting political news, you have Trump NFL ad roasting Kamala going viral on X Twitter. Now, this also comes to us thanks to End Wokeness, which he says, quote, This ad has been playing nonstop during NFL games for the past few weeks. It's changed the race. Next one is this really quick here. Kamala supports taxpayer-funded sex changes for prisoners. Surgery. Um, for prisoners. Uh, for prisoners. Every transgender inmate in the prison system would have access. It's hard. Wait, every one of them? Is that in the Constitution? I, uh, well, we just talked about the federal government. I mean, their budget being way too high. And while they, they go negative every year, like, oh, yeah, they're going to pay for that, too. Hard to believe, but it's true. Even the liberal media was shocked Kamala supports taxpayer-funded sex changes for prisoners and illegal aliens. Every transgender inmate would have access. Kamala's for they, them. President Trump is for you. I'm Donald J. Trump, and I approve this message. Yep, and there's another picture of, what is that? Sam guy? There's a man, a bald man with a mustache, who wore dresses, and apparently had access to the U.S. launch codes for nukes. And he went around to airports and would steal people's luggage, women's luggage, so they could perversely wear their unmentionables. And only after like the fourth or fifth time was he actually fired for his ineptitudes. And they say uh, Republicans are weird. I mean, <laughs> that is the ultimate definition of the pot calling the kettle black. And yeah, in terms of all the things that are money it's spent for on a federal level, all the tax dollars, just should you pay for that too? No, absolutely not. I, I can't think of a single founding father or doc, a Federalist document that would support that. Now, got about 260,000 views and 4.6 thousand likes. The first comments, oh, that was the guy's name. Base electrician says, quote, Sam Britton has unintentionally become Trump's most effective cheerleader. There's a, another picture of Sam, which, naked with, more, I'm normally, green is, green makes for a good car, not much, not so much for a good dress. Wearing a green dress and green lipstick, which, Although the color is green, that has to be the biggest red flag on the planet. Anyone, with the exception of Halloween, well, in this case, even not Halloween for him, but anyone who wears a green lipstick, pretty big red flag. Now, that got 580 views and 8 likes. We got more than that. Yeah, Paul Zupa saying, quote, No one wants far-left gender ideology extremists of Kamala, not even Democrats, getting 18 likes, which, I don't know about that. I think, I think a lot of them are going to vote blue no matter who, and a lot of them... Now you're going to fall in, line with, fall in line with the party mantra. You have Gunther Eagleman and says, quote, the woke mind virus has to be stopped getting 83 likes. Let's see here. The Rook at Media TM has a picture of Kamala, and it says, quote, I promised to do everything I could have done but didn't do because I, because if I did, I wouldn't have to promise to do it, even though I could do it now, but, but don't because I don't know what to do or I would have done it. Which is probably made up, but is ser shockingly similar to her user vernac vernacular of talking in circles, it sounds like it could be true. I did get 16 likes as well. Liberty, you know, Liberty Pill Memes, which did in fact respond to meme form, say, quote, don't change your gender at birth. Or says, do not, do not change your birth gender. And it's a picture of Willy Wonka looking creepy. It says, if genitals don't define gender, how does removing them affirm it? That got 59 likes. See here. Anti-woke meme says, why do Democrats do this for criminals? Miss um, CBS Austin, of course it's Austin, says inmate who strangled 11 month, you, oh Jesus, inmate who strangled 11 month old will get taxpayer funded gender surgery judge rules. Not surprising this person has about a bucket of, well not a bucket, I'm not sure what the metrics are in terms of tattoo ink, but their whole face is inked with designs to look like a mask. Got 27 likes. anti left memes also says they need to be moved to the prisons, into from prisons into institutions. There's a picture of the Simpsons that says where the woke used to live before the 70s. Getting, met, getting 14 likes. Yeah, a lot of people are starting to critique Ronald Reagan more and more for that. Uh, getting rid of those. Red Rave Press also says most Americans completely disagree with this. Great ad by Team Trump getting 27 likes, which I do think, I think most, I do think more than 51% of Americans do agree that federal tax dollars should not be used for that. Eh, oh, jeez. Jared Marsh has a picture of well, it's Photoshop or perhaps Microsoft Paint, which I joke is my Photoshop, but it's a picture of Kamala and Joan of Corvette. And it says, get in the job or get in, loser. We're going to fix the economy. Or I should use, a, use Biden's accent. Get it. Come on, man. Get in, loser. We're going to fix it. We're fixing the economy. And it's uh, heartbreaking only because it's a uh, Corvette's been hit into a light pole. It's a, uh, was it a C5 Corvette? Might even be a Z06. Which used to have 405 horsepower and only came with a stick shift. It's all car stand by default, obviously. 
That also got four likes. We also have the right answer saying, highlighting how extreme Kamal Harris is and will always be the winning strategy, getting three likes. Old School Eddie says, it shows off her true character and what and what she holds important, getting five likes. Which, yeah. Not, too, not seeing too many contrarian statements here. I mean, now that being said, I mean, shoot, there are some people who do agree with Kamal Harris and think it's a great idea. You must have called San Franciscans. I'm only partially kidding. But I do think for the average NFL viewer, I think it's going to be effective advertisement. I think it'll push maybe some people who don't realize that they're, they're again, I mean, if people knew how much stuff their federal tax, uh, their taxes are being wasted upon, they'd probably be irate and be a revolution overnight. But I do suspect that the average American would not appreciate their federal tax, their, tax, their federal income tax going to stuff like that. And maybe it'll push them to vote for Trump. But let me know in the comments because, as always, be fascinated to hear what you have to say. Thank you, everyone, for taking the time to tune in. Again, try to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So if you can click that button, I'd greatly appreciate it. Also, give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, or comment. It's a great way to give me some additional feedback, letting me know how I can make the show better and better. Lastly, don't forget to take time to tell your family, tell your friends, tell your coworkers, heck, tell your enemies, anyone and everyone. Just stay safe. Fight the good fight.